time has come. The evil force lies in wait on the planet of New Texas below. It wants to destroy us, as it did our people. Though I have taught you much, you are not yet ready to face this evil. For now, I must face it alone. In a few moments, this ship will crash on the planet below. Even with all my magic, I may not survive. But you shall, child. You and the powers of your destiny. There is a galactic Marshall space station within range of your emergency capsule. I have ensured that they shall find and care for you when you awaken. If the fates permit, we will meet again. And should that come to pass, you will know me. By this. Farewell. to destruction, and so you may. But I shall surround this ship with walls of stone. And if I survive this crash, be warned, evil one. Your rule of terror shall be no more. <laughs> Planet. 
my dominion of evil is threatened. I need an ally, a servant, and I sense one nearby. Come on, move it, you vomit! <laughs> How lucky can you get? Not only is this godforsaken planet rich, terium, the rarest element in the universe, but it's also got this handy supply of furry critters to use as slaves. Ain't that wonderful, my dear ex-partner? <laughs> You inhuman monster! You have no right to treat them! Shut up, McBride. You're lucky I let you live. Hey! Get back to work, critter! Girl, Daddy will be home soon. No, he won't. Ain't no room for excess baggage, McBride. Including you. You greedy fool! You overload the ship! That's too much carrium! No such thing as too much carrium! Adios, partner. I'll leave you here with these buzz balls. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> Even as the evil alliance between Tex Hex and Stampede is formed, the galactic rescue ship arrives to save McBride. But as they do so, the great wealth of the planet is revealed to all the galaxy, and so it begins. And now they shall come, the good and the bad, the best and the worst, the miner, the merchant, and the criminal. Greed will bring them, bring them here into my grasp. Thus is my plan. Those who are evil shall be recruited into an army of terror such as the galaxy has never seen. And those who are good shall be destroyed. Thus, as the years pass, the galaxy comes to the planet of New Texas. It will never be the same again. Howdy, man. Even as the mining town grows and prospers through the years, Tex Hex, under Stampede's secret orders, recruits the planet's outlaws into a powerful gang of terror. In the town, he finds Sandstorm, a powerful villain, and easy to recruit. Many criminals threaten the carrier shipments, but only the most evil, such as Cactus Head, a matter-changing mechanism of menace, can truly be considered for the gang. Is dangerous. And will stop at nothing in order to satisfy his criminal greed. Uh, he is just what Tex Hex is looking for. The search takes Tex Hex to the mining camps. Where he discovers the reptilian renegade Vipra. Her paralyzing Venomizer allows her to freely loot the hard earned wealth of the honest miners. But Tex Hex promises greater conquests and greater rewards. Lonely showdown in the middle of the desert is discovered the evil Thunderstick, whose blasting arm can defeat most anybody. But not all. As Tex Hex proves. It has to stop. Why, we put up with these outlaws for too many years, and they just get worse. Dang right. Mama get tired of having my stage robbed every day. Hey, get out of here, you critters. 
this meeting's only for people. Skidam! <laughs> I've overheard rumors that Tex Hex is forming up a gang. And I say that if we don't get some law around here, I'm gonna start making some of my own. No, 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 hold on a minute. We can't take the law in our own hands. I, I have been thinking of calling for a planetary marshal. One? Heck, may we need a dozen. A hundred! A thousand! Well, now, them some right pretty speeches y'all been making. But you're wasting your breath talking about lawmen. Because from now on, I'm the law around here. And I'd like all of you to meet a few of my deputies. They're all gonna help me make this the kind of planet I like. We won't take orders from outlaws, tex -Hex. Now get out of our town! Our town? My town, Handlebar. No! One else? <laughs> I thought not. So when we mean business, boys. Wreck the place! <laughs> Good. I'm awake. I was afraid you just might be a beautiful dream. Oh, knock it off. Name's Brave Star, ma'am. Don't call me ma'am. No, JB. Don't get snippy with the young fella. I'm Angus McBride. You must be one of the army of marshals New Texas is waiting for. Well, yes and no. I'm a marshal, but there's no army, Mr. McBride. Just me, Brave Star. They only sent one marshal? Well, there's only one uprising. <laughs> He's got you there, Father. Hi. I'm the new judge of New Texas. I guess we'll be working together, huh? You're a galactic judge? Yeah, that's right. Any objection? Oh, no, nothing like that. It's just you're awful pretty for a judge. I'm also a good one. I'll thank you to remember that. Your attention, please. This is Captain Andrews. We're approaching the asteroid shoal surrounding New Texas and we'll be landing shortly. Crew, please prepare for docking. Thank you. He is coming. 
Many long years have I waited for this moment. The days of evil here are numbered. Ah, hero! That sense is a broke. A serious threat. <laughs> no matter what. He will never arrive! Oh, isn't this exciting? Don't you want to see this, Marshal? I was raised in space, Judge. Frankly, I'd rather... Look out! That should hold it temporarily. Galloping galaxies! Twenty years in the newspaper business, and I've never seen anything like that! Neither have I. I... I mean... How could you be so strong? I... I honestly don't know, ma'am. I mean, JB, it just happens sometimes. Not often. I don't know how. Can't control it. Excuse me, I better notify someone about that breach. Well, how about that? What do you think, Father? I think I'm beginning to understand why they only sent one marshal. For the failure. The hero still lives, but this battle is far from over. Go, my servant! Find this hero they call Brave Star, then when you have found him, Destroy him! That's an unusual medallion, Brave Star. Where'd you get it? From a great teacher who cared for me when I was young. I don't know what happened to him, but so long as I have this, I feel he's close to me. But it looks like they got the welcome mat out for you, Judge. Well, you better let me hold your thing so you can wave at him. Oh, uh, yes. Uh, thank you, Brave Star. Oh, how nice of them. Must be. He's wearing a star. Well, where are all the others? They must still be on the freighter. <laughs> and we was worried about law and order coming to New Texas. <laughs> they look real cute in them dresses. Yeah! <laughs> real <laughs> cute! Hello. Hi. Oh, it's nice to see you. This must be a joke. Thank you for coming to meet me. What a nice way to greet your new judge. Guys, we didn't come to see no judge lady. We're here to see our new marshals. Mm -hmm. Ooh, you tricked me, Brave Star. Oh, no, ma'am. I wouldn't. Don't bother denying it, Brave Star. I know you did. You did it deliberately just to embarrass me. Pay no attention to her, Brave Star. Unfortunately, my daughter inherited my hot temper. But, well, how did it rise? Is that Tex? I didn't figure he'd still be alive. Well, no thanks to you. Figures a tender foot like you will end up a cripple. And who's the frilly 
pilly with you. Hey, Miss Marshall, you want us to carry your skirts? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> your skirts? <laughs> them, them hat boxes look mighty heavy for a little filly like you. You're right, boys. They are heavy. Reckon I'll take you up on your offer. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> Set everything down here, boys. Much obliged for your help. I'm Marshal Bravestar. You folks have a law against carrying weapons in public places? I, 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 I'm afraid not. Well, then we'll have to make one. That's your department, I think, Judge. Yes, that's right, Marshal. And I think the first law... Shut up, Judge. This here is my town now. And I didn't come here to listen to you jabber. I came here to make prairie stew out of this parasol packing peace. Officer. Yeah, parasol packing peace officer. <laughs> well, in that case, sir, you, your rodent, and that tin can are under arrest. Tin can! <laughs> Laugh this off, Marshal. I'm starting to get real annoyed with you, Marshal Bravestar. I already taught these people a lesson, but I think I'm gonna have to give you some spatial instruction. Get him, boss! You folks better get to safety. This is my job. You two little part, but thanks. Do as he says. Watch yourself, Brave Star. Tex Hex is meaner than a sand hornet. Yes, and I should know.
axis. Oh. Oh. Destiny you must fulfill. Remember now. Our people discovered a great power. But that power was desired by the evil Stampede. I said that our power plant must be protected at all costs. Oh. If only I had known the final price. forgive myself but from destruction came creation a new power a new hope a new hero
brave star. Ah, you have awakened. Greetings, brave star. We meet again. I have waited for this moment for many years. Shaman! Now is the hour of your destiny, brave star. Across the voids of space and time, we have rejoined to stand together against the forces of evil. Now I may unlock the four great animal powers born within you and give them into your control. Eyes of the Hawk! Ears of the Wolf! Strength of the Bear! Speed of the Puma! <laughs> you are Brave Star! Hero of New Texas! to see you. Why, this is, this is a baby picture of me. Where, where did you get this? Oh, <laughs> you can't speak our language. J B. J B. Glad to meet you, Fuzz. Glad to meet you, baby. <laughs> That's wonderful. You'll be speaking our language in no time. <laughs> Your powers will make you mighty, Brave Star. But you need one thing more. A weapon. But I have weapons. Mere toys. Put them away. You need a great weapon. One that you may trust with your life. And you shall find it there. But it will not be easy to obtain. Nothing's been easy so far. Wish me luck. Speed of the Puma!
Must be it. The weapon. lost. Wonder how it got here. Sure are a funny looking horse, aren't you, boy? We'll find your owner later. Right now, I better get what I came for. So I gave you a chance, but I see now that you have come to plunder like all the others. Now wait, I, I can explain. Lies! You'll just hold still for a minute. Maybe I can explain. I was sent here to get a great weapon. But I am not a thief. If the weapon belongs to you, I'll go and leave you in peace. Adios. We ain't finished. Ain't never lost a fight before, and I don't intend to lose this one. The place is collapsing. We have to get out of here. I have been defeated. When the mountain falls, I'm gonna fall with it. I'm not leaving you here. You ain't got a choice. some sense into me. I guess I owe you one. Nah. I say we're even. Nope. Not yet. <laughs> 
Now we're even. You sent me to get the great weapon, but I failed. I could not bring myself to take it from 3030, its rightful owner. You did not fail, Brave Star. I did not send you to get another toy. <laughs> I sent you after a great weapon, one that you could trust with your life. This you have found. It is called friendship. Mm, I can't stand people that talk in riddles. He said our friendship would be our greatest weapon. Where's the riddle in that? Friendship? <laughs> well, it may not be a riddle, but it sure is a joke. <laughs> Town's wide open Now that that dang marshal and judge are gone You vomits ready to ride? You're in! Let's party! <laughs>
Looks like I got my work cut out for me. Uh, for us, you mean. You'll be oh so, be oh so, you. Now, wait a minute. You don't have time to argue, Brave Star. Besides, I'm the judge. Let's go. Hasn't even begun yet, Mayor. You speak truthfully, Brave Star. I must warn you, there is more evil on this planet than you know. Even now, Tex Hex prepares to gather great forces of evil to help him in his vengeance. He will attack tomorrow. You must make ready. Now we've got a lot of work ahead of us. This town is going to be a lot different when we get done with it. Let's get to it. I sent out the word, Stampede, and they're here. Every hoodlum varmint and villain on the planet, they're coming here to join me in my revenge! You amuse me, Hex. An army of vermin, cowards, and cheats with such as these? You would attack Bravestar? A win. Me. And maybe not! When you are ready to attack again, I shall summon my servants from the very sands of the desert to help you. <laughs>
Glad to see you. I was wondering where you were. No, oh, I go the way. Town folk not like wary people. Call us quitters. But don't worry. No one's going to treat you badly while I'm around. Because that's the law. Ow! No, oh, hear me do it, Marshal Brave Styles. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Thanks, Fuzz. I owe you one. Good, cause Fuzz needs favor. All right, Fuzz. What is it? Oh, you and JB Law people, and you helps make bad things good. I, I, I want to make bad things good, too. I want to be law person. But, Fuzz, it's dangerous. Wanna be your man? Fuzz? Bravestar! Oh, Marshal oh. Bravestar! We, 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 we've got a problem, Marshal. Even with everybody working at hyperspeed, we are not going to be done by tomorrow. We're in trouble. Then we need more workers. No, oh, more? We've got every citizen in the place working already. Where are we going to find more? Right here. Oh, No, 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 hold on there, Marshal. We don't want the help of these pesky critters. It's time to put aside all prejudice, Mayor. We need their help. By the way, I was just telling Fuzz that if I ever hear anybody call him Critter, I'd bounce their bottoms right out of town. No, 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 just wait a minute, Marshal. I was the one who hired you here in the first place. That doesn't make you above the law, Mayor. Right, Judge? That's right, Marshal. So, Mayor, are you going to apologize or make like a rubber ball? Oh, uh, all right. Mm. I apologize. No! Oh! Goodies, goodies, oh, and I'll fix your ticketing too. Very people's good at that. Amazing. Oh, um, uh, sir, I, I can see we need your people's help very badly, and 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 we'd be right grateful for any assistance oh. you could give us. Take it easy. Hmm. Tex Hex and his gang will be damaging the place enough as it is. Oh, I know. I I'm sorry. It's just that I... I don't know, I guess I'm tired. Uh, and, well, I I'm... Scared? I know. Me too. You're afraid? Of course. Did you expect me not to be? Well, I, I mean, I, I didn't, I didn't... Anyone who says they aren't afraid just before a fight is either a liar or not telling the truth. I guess. Oh, but it's hard. I, I keep looking out there, knowing what we're facing tomorrow, wondering if I'll ever see another sunrise. You will. Many more. 
<laughs> Wish I had your confidence. I mean, we're so badly outnumbered. JB, I can't promise you victory, but I can promise you that I'll do my best to protect you and the people of Fort Carrium. That's good enough for me. Thank you, Brave Star. I feel better now. So do I. Um, uh, now, um, let's get back to work. Now, um, let's get back to work. You're the judge. Just take it easy on the equipment. Activation machinery ready yet? Partner, sometimes you can be a real pain. Here they come again. We got some stomping to do.
of evil. Now, I shall rule again. Rise, my servants! Rise and serve your
partner. We need help. Shaman, it's time! No! Stampede! Across space and time, the moment has come, evil one. Two forces will now join to defeat you, the powers of myself and Brave Star! Thanks for popping up, little partner. Here I am, boss! <laughs> I'll help you! Oh, let me out of Let me out of him! Oh, my! Ah, the evil has been conquered. Good has triumphed at last. I can rest. Celebrate? Nope. You all do the celebrating. You earned it. 
As for me, now that all the excitement's died down, Shaman and I have got a lot of stories to swap while he recovers. Adios. Just remember, if you need me, I'll be around. Anyways, come on, amigo, sweet water's on me. Come on, daughter, let's celebrate. Oh. Hmm. Come on, deputy. <laughs> <laughs>